There are some really beautifully made models coming out of Europe now. Uh, these are all REE models and they represent French prototypes. Um, the level of detail is superb, right down to sprung buffers and etched grills, etched footsteps. This is the Austerity tank locomotive, an O3O TU. Now the majority of the, the Continental manufacturers supply their models with this style of coupling, which is a lifting loop over a spigot. Because of the lifting loop, the coupling gap is actually quite generous, shall we say. So the, the purpose of this film is to look at a solution to this problem. So here's one of the, the drawbacks of this style of coupling, and it's a coupling that's supplied with Hornby International, Lilliput, REE, and Roco wagons, and some of the Trix wagons as well, is that you can't just lift one out, you've got to sort of ease it out or uncouple it. So here I reveal the purpose of having the Fleischmann track over my normal test track. So I've got the uncoupler there, which I'm just going to activate, and drive the local out. So the, the, the standard couplings are still usable with uncouplers and things. So to remove the coupling, it's, these are on an NEM pocket, so a majority of modern stock now has them fitted. I've got my little tweezers there and I'm going to squeeze the tails together and then gently ease the coupling out. You don't want to yank it because you don't want to pull the coupling head off here. So that's an NEM pocket on a swing link. And it's a nice chance to see the, the detail under, underneath these wagons. So the coupling I've chosen for my close coupling is the Fleischmann Profi coupling. So these are a, a claw coupling linked together. You can link, lift them out. They can also still be lifted and uncoupled that way. To insert a coupling, just support the, the coupling head here and gently ease them in. You may need to squeeze the tails slightly and then push them home. So that's the coupling in there now. First thing you notice with the fly from Profi couplers is just how much closer everything sits together. You know, almost buffer to buffer. So a big advantage of the Profi couplings is the ability to remove items from a rake without having to derail all the rest of the rake. And then they just hook up again, he says. There we are. Profi couplers. We can come up to the ramp. Pre and couple. So we've got that. Push back. Then you can leave the wagons. So you've got that pre uncoupling ability which is very useful for marshalling trains. Another important factor of close coupling is how it deals with curvature. So this is Fleischmann Radius 1. And if I track this through, I've got a reverse turn there. So the Profi couplings allow flexible free running without buffer lock and derailment. So here we have a couple of coaches with the close coupling. We're on flight from radius 1 still, and there we are, it deals with it fine. So we now see one of the REE Pacifics, um, dynamic smoke, always fun. And whilst I'm showing off the smoke, it's really all about the profi couplings and how close they bring the train together.